Good morning and good night. This is the workbook of A Course in Miracles. Today we've come this far together at lesson number 42. God is my strength. Vision is his gift. The idea for today combines two very powerful thoughts, both of major importance. It also sets forth a cause and effect relationship that explains why you cannot fail in your efforts to achieve the goal of this course. You will see because it is the will of God. It is his strength, not your own, that gives you power, and it is his gift rather than your own that offers vision to you. God is indeed your strength, and what he gives is truly given. This means that you can receive it any time and anywhere, wherever you are and in whatever circumstance you find yourself. Your passage through time and space is not at random. You cannot be but in the right place at the right time. Such is the strength of God. Such are his gifts. We will have two three to five minute practice periods today. One as soon as possible after you wake up. Good morning. And another as close to the time as possible to the time you go to sleep. Good night. <laughs> It is better, however, to wait until you can sit quietly by yourself at a time when you feel ready than it is to be concerned with time as such. Begin these practice periods by repeating the idea for today slowly with your eyes open. God is my strength. Vision is his gift. Looking about you, then close your eyes and repeat the idea again. God is my strength. Vision is his gift even slower than before. After this, try to think of nothing except thoughts that occur to you in relation to the idea for today. You might think, for example, vision must be possible, God gives truly, or God's gift to me must be mine because he gave them to me. Any thought that is clearly related to the idea for today is suitable. You may, in fact, be astonished at the amount of course-related understanding some of your thoughts contain. Let them come without censoring unless you find your mind is merely wandering and you have let obviously irrelevant thoughts intrude. You may also reach a point where no thoughts at all seem to come to mind. If such interferences occur, open your eyes and repeat the thought once more while looking slowly about. God is my strength. Vision is his gift. Close your eyes. Repeat the idea once more and then continue to look for related thoughts in your mind. Remember, however, that active searching for relevant thoughts is not appropriate for today's exercises. Try merely to step back and let the thoughts come. If you find this difficult, it is better to spend the practice period alter alternating between slow repetitions of the idea with eyes open than with eyes closed than it is to strain to find suitable thoughts. There is no limit on the number of short practice periods that would be beneficial today. <laughs> the idea for the day is a beginning step in bringing thoughts together and to teaching you that you are studying a unified thought system in which nothing is lacking that is needed and nothing is included that is contradictory or irre irrelevant. It's incredible. The more often you repeat the idea during the day, the more often you will be reminding yourself that the goal of this course is important to you and that you have not forgotten the goal of this course because God is my strength and vision is his gift today on the 42nd day of the workbook of A Course in Miracles it can work for you